Good morning and welcome to school today. I am doing our morning announcements actually um, early um, from my office because I have an 8 o'clock meeting at Central Office so I won't be here. So I wanted to make sure that we got all of our morning meeting stuff done um, before you guys get your day started. And when you would you please do the pledge once we finish up, okay? So today is the, what is today? Today is the 14th of September, and here's what we're going to be having for lunch today. We are having Wild Mike's Cheesy Bites, Garden Salad, Marinara Cup, Apple Sauce, and Chocolate Chip Cookies. Let's see if we have any birthdays for the 14th of September. Today is Jake Wheeler's birthday. It is also uh, Alexander Hordyk's birthday. It is also Alejandro Rodriguez Walton's birthday. And we don't have any grown-up birthdays today. Okay, let's see. Our attendance was fabulous yesterday. Um, and it was 96.4. So that means tomorrow I'll be in a costume and so will someone else. So you need to be sure to be here on Thursday to, make sure, to see who else is in a costume with me, all right? First grade had our best attendance yesterday, and they'll be dismissed first. And then we had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight perfect attendance home rooms. That was Houston, Johns, Lee, McDermott, Rowe, Shelton, Smitty, and Watkins. Great job, you guys. I love how we're working so hard at getting to school uh, each day. Remember that our manner of the week is don't use foul language. Don't use cuss words. Don't use those bathroom words. Just say nice words. Okay, that's really, uh, that's very impolite to use that kind of language. Um, also, don't forget book fair is still going on. I think that Thursday is really our last big day. Um, and I know that uh, fifth grade is shopping for or can shop with a grandparent after Grandparents Day. And then these groups are going in today. That's Lee, Johns, Rupert, and Shipley. And then for tomorrow, it will be Denton, Rowe, Kells, and Smitty. Okay. Um, and don't forget to take your little coupon if you read your book over the summer so that you can get that discount. Um, and remember, please, to check on the Lost and Found and see if anything is yours, okay? All right, let's see here. We've got several Red Oak Raider um, role model things. And I'm going to um, try to add some of these to myself because I had a suggestion from Finn Smith that I try to do some Raider role models from Carline because we, we do see some people who are doing everything they're supposed to. Here's one for Antonio Perez. He was confident with using the standard algorithm in math. Logan Clark from Miss Arena was respectful of our place. Eli G from Miss Rose class helped a classmate find her glasses. Melody in Miss Rose class really worked hard on Noun Town. That sounds exciting. Bree Murphy helped a friend pick up a mess in the hall. Camden Wright passed 11 lessons in I Ready Math in two days. That is simply amazing. Sawyer Fritz expected to learn. He always raises his hand to answer questions. Uh, Lila in Mr. Spradlin's class. This is from music. Help clean up after class and music. Uh, Tegan Gray in Miss McDermott's class can spell Kentucky. That's pretty impressive. And Alex in Miss Spradlin's, Mr. Spradlin's room, and this is from music, also help pack up and clean up. Anna Bobchinek from Miss Houston's class came in early and put all our chairs down for class. Let's see. Rowan in Mr. Shelton's class paid attention. Bristol in Mr. Shelton's class paid attention. And Corinne from Mr. Shelton's class paid attention. Great job, you guys. Love reading those red oak role models. Okay, I got a joke yesterday. Someone brought it to me. I think it was Nathaniel Clark. Why couldn't the forest get into the computer? because they couldn't log in. <laughs> I know that was a funny one too. And then let's see if my book has a couple. Let's see. What's a zucchini's favorite game? It's squash. That's a game you play with balls, I think so. Um, and let's see. Why wouldn't the lion eat the clown? Because he tasted funny. <laughs> That's a fun I like that one too. So, All right. Say those Red Oak expectations with me, please. Respect ourselves, others, and our place expect to learn, do our best, own our behavior, 
Always treat others the way you want to be treated and know we can. It is super important to me that you are kind to one another, that you keep your hands and feet to yourselves, and that, you, that our hallways and our bathrooms are silent places. Thanks for being so flexible during our grandparents' day lunches. Um, tomorrow's our last one, so hopefully we'll be able to, fifth grade um, finishes up so we shouldn't have to alter any kind of schedules or anything like that. So, all right, have a great day. Do your work and do it well. I'll be back in just about an hour and a half, um, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Love you guys.